In the beginning of the book, uh, Tom lied to Congress about um, his involvement with Russia. I am Julie Clam. I'm the author of The Stars in Our Eyes, and I'm doing a last minute book report on Tom Sawyer. I have not read Tom Sawyer, although I have no doubt that I was assigned it at some point in school and didn't read it. I'm, I'm going to speed read the entire book. And by speed reading, I mean just look at the pages. Right now, I'm feeling my English teacher, Miss um, Montgomery, crying in her Upper West Side apartment because um, I don't know this. I'm still very close to her, by the way. I'll tag her in the Facebook post. When I read this book, it, the, what it tells me about childhood of this era is that they, they didn't have smartphones. There was no Wii. So they had to play outside and, and uh, paint fences, because what else will you do? Tom actually releases into a church the spirit of George Washington, um, which he had in a, in a can, in, a, in an, an old coffee can, which also in the olden days is what, when people died, spirit went into a coffee can, they put it away, Tom got his hands on it, went into the church, George Washington flying around. Tom wants to uh, win a Bible in Sunday school and he actually has to eat 172 hot dogs um, in less than 10 minutes to beat Joey Chestnut's record and, and he did. It was amazing.